Hey Buns Gamers, Ghost here with another episode of Flight of the Amazon Queen. Uh, all these three here. So yes. Squawk! What a pretty bird. Polly want a cracker? Uh oh, Princess Azura is in trouble. Uh oh, Rah! oh, oh, squawk! Hey, you can talk. Squawk! Help me, Trader Bob. You're my only hope. Uh -oh. Say the book. Oh, uh oh, squawk! Who's Trader Bob? And who's Princess Azura? Squawk! I'm being held captive. You must save me. Uh oh! What on earth are you talking about? Who's holding who captive? Squawk! Uh oh! Help me, Trader Bob! You're my only hope! Uh oh! Squawk! Hey, uh, come back here! That's just great! I've only just arrived uh, in the jungle, and already I get a cryptic message. Maybe this Trader Bob character can shed some light. Can I grab the vine? Oh, yes, we can open it, eh? Oh, look at banana. The bridge isn't safe enough to cross. Uh, I don't use on spot beat loop. Ah, there you go. It's, uh, pick up banana. Banana in yeah, pajama. Boy, there sure are a lot of bananas up there. Oh, there you go. Most famous scene of this game, yes. Phew, that sure is big. Right. Talk to Gorilla. Um, hi. I'm Joe King. Uh, sorry, Pobot. Did I pay? Sorry, pal, but I don't speak good ape. Unga. <laughs> Say, uh, you're a gorilla, ain't ya? Uh-huh. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, uh, gorilla. Uh, I thought gorillas came from Africa. I thought gorillas came from Africa. Uh, 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 Chunga, uh, Unga. Say, buddy, I think you're right. Gorillas are only found in Africa. This is South America. You shouldn't be here. This is South America. You shouldn't be here. Gee, you're right. I guess I'd better get going then. How freaky! A phantom primate. Right. Um, come on. Talk to Blinter. Phoenix. Meanwhile, back at the crash site. Chocolate blur. Come on, you bum. That creep has left us here. He makes me so mad. I feel better now. That was expensive perfume. So? I'm rich. I can do whatever I want. What are you going to do now? Bitch. I'm going for help. But Joe said to stay put. Well, he can go jump in the lake. Hmm. Up to Trader Bow. Trader Bob. Welcome to Trader Bob's 24 hour general store and authentic native village playground. Is Tad allowed? 
talk to pygmy. Hello, what are you looking at? Uh. Hey, I'm talking to you. I'm talking here. Hi, I'm Joe King. You took a you want to go. What took a bad to go? Walk to Trader Bob's 24 areas. So we meet again, my fine feathered friend. Indubitably. Howdy, son. My name's Trader Bob. I run this shop with Naomi over there. What can I do for you? Are you the same Trader Bob that this parrot told me about? Maybe. What else did that parrot tell you? Well, he told me about some princess. Azura, I think her name was. He said that she was in trouble. Listen, buddy. We gotta talk. What's your name? Joe King. My name's King. Joe King. Pilot for hire. Well, Joe, Princess Azura is a good friend of mine, and she's been kidnapped. I don't know who's responsible, but I have my suspicions. Of I course. may need your help in finding her. Are you interested? Uh, okay, I'll fill me in the okay, details. Okay, I'll help. Fill me in on the details. Great. I knew you'd help. I think that Floda, a lederhosen company, kidnapped Azura. She was last seen near their camp earlier today. It'd be great if you could check the place out. What do you think that... What, uh, what makes you think that Floda kidnapped her? What makes her? you think that Floda kidnapped her? A number of other people have gone missing near there. Besides, Floda has electric fences and vicious guard dogs. Isn't that a little odd for a clothing company? Uh, what's a Lederhosen company doing in the Amazon? What's a Lederhosen company doing in the Amazon? Exactly. From what I can tell, the Lederhosen is just a cover for their real activities. I don't know what they're up to, but Sex I'm traffic. sure it's no good. No? <laughs> what exactly is Lederhosen? Lederhosen? Why, it's clothing. You know, sort of like leather shorts, I think. Not the sort of thing you'd wear in this hot weather. Now that I have the details, I guess I'll be off. You'll find Floda on the other side of the pinnacle. Be careful, Joe. And if you need any more help, just ask. Uh, all your money. Close off your back. And possibly five bucks. Hi, I'm Joe King, pilot of Aya. Can I help you? Uh, Where did you learn to speak English? The missionaries in the jungle can speak pygmy, so they taught me how to speak English. I'm the only one in my village that what? can speak it fluently. Fluently. Uh, where can I find the mission? Where can I find these missionaries? They have their mission in the jungle. If you're thinking of asking them to teach you pygmy, forget it. They won't teach you for nothing. How come Bob over there didn't teach you? Bob's a nice guy and all, but his grasp of the English language is a little limited. He thinks grandma is the person who washes his grandfather's socks. <laughs> Thanks for your time. That's okay. Give beef turkey. It's empty. That's right, son. A new supply of beef jerky should be through any day now. Yeah. You look a little hungry. I've got some beef jerky. Would you like some? You bet I would. I'll even pay for it. That's okay. You can have it for free. No, I insist. Here, have some money. Gee, thanks. No, thank you. I can see where all the um. I'm rich. Beef jerky. Meanwhile, in a secret bunker deep on the on the ground. Has there been any success in finding the crystal skull? Uh, not yet, Doctor Einstein. I have my best men looking for it in the temple. Of course, your eyes. I must have that skull soon. It's the key to gaining entry to the Valley of the Mists. Yeah, and the to obtaining the more dinosaur samples. Exactly. 
And with my new dino ray, I can begin building my army of dinosaur women. Is that some kind of Excellent, fetish for, of him? Then I shall rule the world! <laughs> yes, sir. Whatever you say, sir. What, with sexy dinosaur women? Mannequins are wearing later hosen. Mmm, it's full of sweet nectar. So we have a flood. Do we combine that with a chunk of meat and give it to the, to the dog? Toad sloth. It's hanging out over the ravine. What chill back guy? Hi, I'm Joe King, pilot for hire. Hello, Joe. I'm Bud, and my friend here is Skip. We're explorers. Good skip. Right. Are you guys professional explorers? Uh huh. That's why we're wearing these spiffy safari jackets and neat <coughs> pit helmets. Yes, they're quite nice. Gee, thanks. Our safari suits are fashionable yet practical, and our pith helmets help create an air of professionalism. What are you looking for in this jungle? We're trying to find the legendary lost tribe of Amazon women. The tribe of Amazons. Why do you want to find a tribe of Amazons? We were previously hmm. captured by them. They took us to their secret Amazon fortress. And then they... They... Uh, I'd rather not say what they did. Sexual stuff. What did they do to you? Well, after they captured us, they, they used us for certain services. The sort of services that only men can provide, if you know what I mean. Cooking. No, I don't really know what you mean. You know, they made us do things that only men have the equipment for. What? Like fixing the thermostat and cutting the grass? Oh, I give up. Yes, they made us fix the thermostat, cut the grass, and take out the garbage. It was dreadful. Do you want to get revenge for being captured? No way. We want to be captured again. How did you get away? Did you escape? Are you kidding? We wanted to stay there. You see, I've got this embarrassing... Rash. It's from the jungle heat, you know. They saw mm -hmm. that and kicked us out. Where is your rash? Um, I'd rather not say. It's rather embarrassing. I'm willing to pay lots of money to get rid of it. Boy, it's hot here. Is it always this hot? You bet it is. It's so hot that you can chafe and end up with a rash. Just like I have. I tell you, a rash cure in this jungle would be worth money. Gee, if I find one, I'll let you know. Thanks. Uh, let's to Skip. Hi, my name's Joe King, pilot for hire. Hello, Joe. I'm Skip, jungle explorer and comic collector. What sort of comics? What sort of things have you discovered? Well, things. well, my partner Bud and I have discovered the ancient wooden chicken of Talmaxa Quarter, the mystical toothpick of the great King Manaputu, 
and the sacred crown of the Sun King. I thought the sacred crown of the Sun King was unearthed last century. Yeah, but the Museum of Mexico lost it in their collection. We helped them find it again, which was no easy task. It took more than three days to look through 50 cardboard boxes. Uh, what comic book were you comic. reading? <laughs> Commander Rocket versus the Mob. It's really good. I've got every issue of the comic. I even have number one sealed in plastic and buried in my backyard. Do you actually collect comic books? Sure, but I also collect the other magazines, like Amazing Stories, Detective Murder Monthly, right. and National Geographic. You read National Geographic? Heck no. I just look at the pictures. What's the one you're reading all about? It's really exciting. Commander Rocket is battling the Chicago mob. But his rocket pack runs out of gas. He has to find some alternative fuel source. Uh, can, how can he battle the mob? How can he battle he the mob? Is he a cop? Not quite. He's a vigilante with a rocket pack. But the cops always help him out. Does he find any new fuel? Of course he does. He always wins out in the end. But you'll have to read the comic to find out how. Do the mobsters kill him? No way. Commander Rocket always gets out of a tight scrape. He's my hero. Thanks for the plot synopsis. That's OK. My friend loves reading Commander Rocket. Another Rocket fan right here in the jungle. What a small world. Here's a message for him in Command the Rocket code. G-S-R-H-R-8-H-V-X-I-V-G-N-V-H-H-Z-T-V. Hmm. My friend has every issue of Rocket but one. Really? Which one is he missing? The one where he battles the Chicago mob. That's the very comic that I've got here. I've got a spare copy at home. If you want, you can have this one. Thanks. This will make Sparky's day. I'm sure it will. I understand <sighs> how important <laughs> this will be to your friend. Those shorts you have on are really swell. Where did you buy them? I don't know. My mommy buys all my clothes for me. I Good gotta go clothes. now. Goodbye. So until next time, ladies and gentlemen, gamers for cans, but smoke me, keep it good, and we'll be back with a good farewell.